Hey up everybody, thanks for waiting. I've got the axle boxes completed now. Uh, I've not shown you how I've done them because I've made another video of when I did the main axle boxes for the Loco. The only difference is I made the other ones uh, split so I could take them off if ever I need to without having to take the wheels off. I'm not that concerned about this these axle boxes because you can actually take the um, the pony truck off quite easy if you need to do any repairs so I've made them uh, all in one piece the only modification I've done other modification is the oil hole it says to drill it straight down into the bore well I've not done that I've gone at, I've gone at an angle and I've put an oil groove down the bore in the centre to pick that oil, to pick that um, hole up. So just to belt and brace it, I've also done what I've done on my other axle boxes, put a end feed oil system on. So what I'm doing, I'm putting these little oil nipples, which I got from uh, China. They're 6mm diameter, 6mm long and they've got a ball bearing and a spring in. And they're going to go into the end of the axles. Then I've drilled... I've drilled a... what size was it? 332nd hole up the axle. Inch and a sixteenth in. So that when the axle boxes are on the axle centre line of the axle box will be will be where that feed hole is, that cross hole that picks this that picks that hole up there. So all it's a matter of doing then is putting your oil can onto that little nipple pump away at that nipple and uh, Bob's your uncle can, I can go ahead and lock tight the other, other wheel on and then uh, we'll reconvene when I'm ready for machining tread on wheels once that lock tight's gone off So just before I go then, on the television yesterday I watched a programme that was um, quite interesting really. It was an auction, it was called The Bidding Room on BBC TV. An auction, auction programme and this chap come on and he got um, Jack Butler's original draftsman stand, all solid cast iron base etc etc quite old it was and very substantial quite interesting that and he even mentioned Jack Butler and the fact that he'd uh, designed the Sweet Pea on program I'll just put a clip somewhere in video uh, and show you that um, draftsman's board that went, went up for auction uh, a bit later on in video, perhaps. Uh, so watch out for that. So I'm going to get this lock tighted on now then, just exactly like I did that one. And then we'll reconvene over on lathe and I'll machine these treads on. And then I can start making all these other little components. Um, just straightforward they are, mainly.
I'll catch you as and when I get onto lathe with these wheels. Thanks for watching. Bye for now then.